this title is fucking crazy, bro. Let's see what niggas was talking about. MVP said she speaks on being not being able to ride with his mother because of the war in Chirac. That's fucking crazy. Um, she come pick me up off the block. I tell her, take me to McDonald's. She put on K and Drive today, McDonald's type shit. This is probably like 2010 type shit. No, don't go here. She... <laughs> the don't go here was mad funny. I ain't gonna lie. Nah, I go where I want to go. Nobody look for me. I'm mm -hmm. like, you sure? See y'all, mm -hmm. we gonna learn your lesson. Put in the drive-thru. On phone them grade, we ordering food, but when we was pulling in that bitch, it was a nigga walking past. And I looked him in his eyes on the Jeep when I was pulling in the fucking parking lot. Soon as by the time we pull up to the first window, Shorty done put right up on the side of that bitch. I'm on go. We had speed in that bitch all the way to some 51st type shit. By the police station on the Jeep, they chasing it. <laughs> on phone them grade, my OG. Ever since then, I'm right. You she I ain't even gonna lie. I wouldn't even get in the car with my moms, bro. I wouldn't be able to. My conscience would not allow me to get in the car with my mother at no given point. If niggas want me that bad, they see my mom. Because obviously, this nigga don't got tense. One. Mom dudes probably don't got tense. So niggas can see y'all. So niggas see who he is and don't even give a fuck. Don't even have an inkling in their mom. Like, damn, you know, that may be his mom's. That may be, you know what I'm saying? But she could look young. But niggas don't even think like, alright, there's somebody else in the car. I could possibly hit them. They don't give a fuck that much, bro, that they willing to hit the, this nigga and somebody else just to get them. Like, think about that. So, let's say hypothetically your girl was in the car that don't got shit to do nothing. Your grandma, your auntie, your daughter, your son. Anybody else is liable to get it just to get you. Man, look, I wouldn't even put mom, do, mama love and no shit like that. First of all, man, prayers. I'm glad niggas got up out of this. Niggas don't want to see nobody die. Because this shit could have got bad. Mom and the son get killed over some shit that son that, that old boy over here did on some on some street shit. Like, bro. That's fucking crazy. I can't even imagine living like that. Like, not being able... My nigga, not being able to go to the store around the corner without having to have a gun on me. All this shit, bro. Man, I pray you... I pray niggas wake up, man. Hope... Stay out the streets, man. I don't even get the streets no more anyway. The streets is clipped. There's too many cameras. This is it's too much technology, bro. Like the, the game was to not get caught. It's too easy to get caught now, bro. I don't want to hear that now. I'm super sturdy. I'm super careful. Niggas moving super tight. Nigga, y'all niggas be going to jail, and y'all don't be having no bread. I mean, nothing. Y'all be having no bread. I'm not even trying to like talk down on niggas, but bro, if you going if you gonna do all this shit, bro, at least have some enough bread put up to you could pay for a lawyer or some shit. Niggas can't bond out. Niggas can't get commissary. Niggas can't do nothing, bro. Y'all be in the streets and be broke. What's the point? What's the point, bro? You feel me? And I, I just I just pray, man. My young niggas or the niggas under me or the niggas after them, just like, man, that shit ain't it, man. Let me go get some real money. Let me go make some real change. Let me go do something different. This shit crazy. This nigga cannot go. To McDonald's, my nigga, with his mom's. I don't think that is the most simplistic task imaginable. You can't do it. Like, imagine you being like, your mom being like, yo, yeah, I'm gonna take you out or, or let's go get some food together. And you're like, nah, man, I can't go with you. Nah, like, I'm, I'm gonna pay for everything you good, sweetheart. Nah, I can't go. I can't be seen with you because niggas might, niggas might try to hop out and boom me because I'm with you, but they not, they not knowing you, my mom's, but they want me that bad. Huh? Nah, bro, that shit is not it, gang. That shit is not one of these every every three seconds. Ah, I mean, I do that personally because you never know anything can happen. It's not just I don't think niggas be out for me, but wrong place, wrong time, or 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 niggas may think like, oh, right, he got money. Ah, ah, I'm not just saying me in general, but anybody. So you gotta be aware. But this a nigga pulling up on the side of you in your mom's jeep, bro. God bless him, bro. Let's see what else I'm talking about, though. She tell me I can't ride with her, and she understand, like, oh, we can go out to the restaurant, I'm, I'm bringing you out, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to tell you when you pull up, when to pull up to my house type shit. Or I'll come bring that shit to you, wherever you at type shit, you know what I'm saying? Because she know, like, this sure. shit real now, because she, she had to get a taste of her own, she had to see it, like, it's not no joke type shit. Nah, nigga, just move. <laughs> just move, man. Just move. If you're a rapper and you got and you making like a, a, a set income off of YouTube, whatever, just some little bread, man, a couple hundred, a couple thousand, bro. I'm pretty sure niggas got a designer coat on. I hope niggas got a couple, band, a couple. You know what I'm saying some bands in their account, nigga. Move to the outskirts, nigga. Move to fucking a different state. You can still do the same shit you want to do. Like, come on, bro. 
and visit here and there, bro. But y'all niggas got to think about longevity. <laughs> you got to fish. You got to end this, man. Niggas out here killing for less, bro. For less, bro, man. Shout out to this young man. Hopefully, he's moving a little smarter. And hopefully, his mom's is, you know what I'm saying? And his family is doing what they're supposed to do. Because this shit tough. Chicago is already dumb crazy. I ain't going to lie. The, the murder rate and shit already be dumb crazy. So, it's the survival just, the survival, su- survivability. It's so minute, my nigga. Prayers, man. Prayers to that city. That shit is crying right now. It's tough. Let me know how y'all feel about this shit, man. You from Chicago? Let me know how this shit is for y'all. Even for the people that's not in the streets. Is it dangerous? What's really going on out there?